this video, we will look at installing vCenter Server 5.5 on a Microsoft Windows platform using the simple install method. This video is based on VMware Knowledge Base Article 2058224. To install vCenter Server 5.5 using simple install, mount the vSphere 5.5 installation media and then the installation wizard will appear. In the left pane, click Simple Install and then click Install. In the Welcome screen, click Next. Review the End User License Agreement. If you agree, select the I accept the terms in the License Agreement option and then click Next. Review the Prerequisites check screen and then click Next. Provide a password for the single sign-on administrator user. Click Next. Provide a site name and then click Next. Note, the site name is used in environments where there are SSO servers in multiple sites. Select this name carefully because it cannot be changed in the vSphere web client after the installation completes. Optionally, provide an alternative TCP port number for the SSO service and then click Next. Optionally, provide an alternative installation location and then click Next. In the confirmation screen, click Install to start the installation. In the license key screen, Enter your vCenter Server 5.5 license key. You can view your license keys in My VMware. If you do not enter a license key, you can proceed with the 60 day evaluation license and you see a pop up which prompts you to acknowledge that you are proceeding without a license. Click Next. Select the database solution for vCenter Server. You can either install a Microsoft SQL Server 2008 Express instance or use an existing supported database. Select the user type that the vCenter server should run with. You can either use the Windows Local System account or use an alternative account. Click Next. Optionally, provide alternative TCP port numbers. Remember, Changing the default ports is recommended only if you have an unchangeable port conflict in the same system. Select an inventory size depending on environmental requirements and click Next. In the confirmation screen, click Install to proceed with the installation. When the installation completes, click Finish. This concludes our look at installing vCenter Server 5.5 on a Microsoft Windows platform using the simple install method. For additional tutorial videos, be sure to subscribe to our KBTV YouTube channel and our KB blog. Thank you for choosing VMware.